Hello everybody! Welcome back to the farm. Today, today I wanna we gotta sell some silage and see how much profitable that is. I have the information tab off again. That's fully ready to go. This stuff is ready to go. I have to uh, plow this. Well, cultivate it. And plant something else. I'm thinking maybe grass, depending on how profitable this, uh, this uh, adventure is today. So, but first, you journey down here, and how am I going to get it into the trailer? I don't remember if this is front loader attachable or not. So we're going to see that. If it is, we're just going to buy a bucket and a front end loader. Uh, assembly and go from there. If not, it's the belt system. Which might be profitable even in the long run. Just to have the belt system at the farm. Uh, customize. Can this do the front end loader? No, it cannot. So, option two I think it's down at the bottom here. Yeah, belt systems. Five grand and 38 for that. Potatoes and sugar beets. Eh. But if I like, want to go full on silage, having a belt would be a lot more profitable than a front end loader. So that would involve a whole other tractor. You want to get one of these little small ones. I'm still going to need a... Bucket. Hmm. Should we at least one? Well, this is a, oh, this is this is just experimental to see how profitable silage is. I know it's the prices fluctuate throughout the seasons, but I don't think I have the ability. Well, I I don't think I know. I don't have the ability to store it. just keep it for another day this is in the beginning here is we're gonna be doing some more contracts I feel just to keep ourselves busy All right, um, let's hook up the trailer Just here. And front end loader. Let's lease it. And I'm gonna need a bucket. Okay. Whoa. She's a big one. I don't think I have the capability of that, though. And we're just going to lose the bucket, too. Because you don't know. <laughs> look, at, look at this thing. Look at this. Oh. Dare I say it's cute.
Slow ride. I just realized. This is a battery powered tractor. The lithium ion symbol and the battery symbol wasn't enough. It has a power gauge on where the fuel should be. That's cool. That is actually really cool. I know they had an electric tractor, but I didn't know they... Open silo. Here we go. Oh, that's cool. If, you don't, if you're full, it just keeps going. Houston, we have a problem. I don't think this picks up high enough. Nope, this does not pick up high enough for that trailer. Temp two. Just. Just. I'll have to keep that in consideration the next time. That's cool that when you if you're if you're pushing, it, you don't just clip through it, you actually push the product up. That is actually a really, really nice uh, quality of life feature. <laughs> I can attach this to the side of the trailer and go for a ride. Uh, Like, I wonder if they have it, uh... Coded in that the electric actually is more efficient... ...than the fuel tractors? Just to kind of... ...promote the, uh... ...the real-life use of them. Like, to go electric, to go green. And I wonder if there's going to be a real life where the more you use it, the weaker the battery gets. Like the more you charge it over time. Really interesting to know. A decent amount of silage just from that tiny little field of corn. Silage always that and soybeans. Those are the two big money makers in this game. Series, I should say. 
that I saw and played with. Are you gonna pick that up or no? I'm going to move back the tractor up and load it from the other side now. I don't know if I can fit this all in one trailer without the sides. I was getting stuck there. Trailer must be full. All right. So, where can we go to sell this stuff? Silage. Bio, the biogas plant. Which is... No idea. Okay. Dealership. Make a left and a building on the right. Okay. It's probably shut. If it's...
push up, make a left. Oh, we're gonna make a right. Hopefully it's not shut. Like some of the mods used to be. Oh, I saw the marker pop up. Start overloading. Oh, that's cool, and they pay you immediately. I kind of like to get paid at. Okay, that was a baby trailer. And we almost equaled the price of the other one. Definitely think we're going to put some grass in the... In that field I need to cultivate. Yep. I wonder if I could do grass multiple times a year. You would think so. Grass in real life grows like a maniac. This farm is so dark. So I have a silo, but I can't store nothing in it. Unless I'm an idiot and just not realizing where I can and cannot do. Oh, alright, yeah. I... Let's see if I can fix this here. Without destroying crops. If I'm going a full on silage farmer, we're definitely going to need to get a belt system. No offense, this is for the birds. Alright, another $992. That wasn't too bad. There actually is a hair left in it, but the machine bucket just would not pick it up at all. Like, I don't know what was going on. May have to deal with that at another date. But we got some cultivating to do. That did take a lot longer than I thought. So, we actually may just 
save the cultivating for another day. Probably tomorrow. Or whenever the next video is. So, I think we have a game plan now that we need to do silage. Well, I want to do silage. Takes a little bit, but it's alright. Need to buy the ability to modify my trailers at the house, too. That would be helpful. Ooh. Oh, this trailer has back steering? Or it's just glitching? I don't know. Alright, well. That is going to be it for this one, I think. See, there's just a little bit left in there. Just a little bit left. Huh, yeah, that's why. Registers as a field being there. Oh well. I don't need you marked anymore. Short so price fluctuations. Oh, it's the highest. It's actually on the increase right now. It's the highest in January and February. Good to know. Wow, that is, cake is all over the map. Anyway, that is going to be it for this episode. Thank you for joining me on the farm today. Like, comment, subscribe, and I will check you all on the next episode. Later.